If you haven't done already, make sure you add me on the new Instagram page, Deep Divers, at official Ralph Smart, because that's where I check the messages. Someone sent me a great message. They're like, Ralph, how can I get out of a despairing mood? Right now, I've lost my business with a lockdown. I've lost my livelihood. I don't know what to do. And there are a lot of people in despair right now on the planet. Deep divers. I've been there. I know what it's like. And I'm going to help you move out of your despair. First and foremost, I wrote on the Instagram. I am attracting everything that is in favor of my greatest good, my highest good. New opportunities, new mindsets, new energy, new love, new abundance. We are all attracting things every single day into our life. The question is, do we want that there? The question is how we see it. You see, I realize that everything I'm attracting is ultimately helping me become my greatest version. Even things I don't want, it's actually a blessing in disguise. If we can change the way we look at things, the way things look at us will also change. The way situations treat us will also change. <sighs> Deep divers, let's just... <sighs> Woo! Breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Raising the frequency. Raising the vibration. Peace. Infinite waters. Diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers. We are out here in the mysterious art gallery. I hope your day is going good. Sending you tons of good ass energy today. Take that. Take that. Take that. Now, are you in a despairing mood? Have you lost the will to move forward with your life? A lot of people are in despair right now. How to get out of a despairing mood? You see, this year, the start of this new decade has brought a lot of trials and tribulations. But I'm here to remind you, deep divers, four words. This too shall pass. And when you realize everything you are going through right now is temporary, you realize to never allow your confusion to become your conclusion. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. To never allow what you are going through temporarily to become a permanent resting place. I don't know a strong person who had it easy, deep divers. All the strong people I know, including myself, we went through despair, but we came out stronger. And we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Why are you always smiling, Ralph? Because I'm grateful. We got to start with gratitude to get ourselves out of a despairing mood. Now, let me tell you this, deep divers. If you are in despair, that's okay. Allow yourself to feel any emotion you are going through without shame or guilt. Let's start there. But what happens when we feel despair? We start to give up. We start to throw in the towel. We start to think that our life is over. No, it's only just begun. Now, Everything you feel right now with a despair is not separate from what is happening on the planet. <laughs> it's all connected. So a lot of people write to me. I get over a thousand messages every single day. Ralph, I feel depressed right now. Ralph, I've got anxiety right now. Ralph, I feel a lot of despair because I lost my job with this COVID-19. I don't know how to move forward. Things are breaking down. Allow your breakdown to be your breakthrough. Realize this. What you are feeling is not separate 
from what is happening on the planet. It's all connected. And when you understand this, understand this, and overstand this, everything changes. You see, the parts are connected to the whole. And when you change one part of your life, all other parts change for the better. When you change one area of your life, all other areas change because they're all connected. If you feel like so much despair right now, a recommendation. As soon as you wake up, go outside. Seasonal affective disorder. Yes, a lot of people have that. It's when you don't get another. It's when you don't get enough sunlight. You miss out on all of that beautiful vitamin D and you can't raise the frequency. So you got to learn how to raise the frequency by making sure you are getting out into nature so you can absorb that vitamin D. Realize to get out of despair. Every single day, remind yourself your story is not over. Remind yourself that it's okay to go through despair. Just don't live there. Don't allow this temporary experience to define who you are. It's just a phase. There are seasons and cycles in this universe for a reason. Why? Why are there seasons and cycles? To make us appreciate each one. If it wasn't for the winter, most people wouldn't appreciate the summer. If it wasn't for the summer, most people wouldn't appreciate the spring. You see, the dark and light are connected. And if it wasn't for the darkness, we would not become illuminated. Only in the dark night can you see the beautiful shining star. So remind yourself that it's okay to go through the dark night of the soul. Just don't live there. And realize that this is part of the metamorphosis. Don't feel that you are this large piece of charcoal. No, you are in the process of becoming a diamond. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. There's a lot of pressure. I know, right? A lot of pressure. It's overwhelming right now on the planet. That's good. All of this pressure is turning you into a diamond because once you overcome it, oh, oh, baby, you're going to have a story to tell. How to get out of despair. Realize this. What you go through is teaching you something. No experience is a wasted experience if you can learn from it. Even a painful experience has a gem inside. We have to find out what the universe wants us to know. It could be that we're feeling sorry for ourselves. You see, when you focus on all of your problems, uh-oh, they multiply. Well, when you focus on just one thing that is going good in your life, like your beautiful smile, yeah, your blessings multiply. Whatever you focus on grows. To get out of despair, ask yourself, what am I focusing on and how is it helping me? Am I focusing on the doom and gloom? The world is going to end. That's going to manifest. Or am I focusing on me evolving every single day, learning more about myself. You're going to have to learn how to face the music of your life. Can you hear the music? I can hear the music. You're going to have to learn how to turn up to your life. Stop taking a back seat in your own life. It's time to learn how to be present in your life. It's time to learn how to face your shadow side. You see, this whole lockdown 
on the planet has brought humanity's shadow out in the open. Everything is getting exposed. To get out of your despair, don't run away. Don't run away from your shadow. Realize that your shadow is your friend. It's showing you things you don't want to see about yourself. Some of them are unpleasant. But if you can confront your shadow side, you will get out of your despair. A lot of people right now on the planet spend a lot of time, a lot of time scrolling through their newsfeed on these social media apps and they're comparing themselves to other people. That's why you feel despair. You see, comparison is the greatest thief of joy. So instead of comparing yourself to other people and feeling bad about yourself on social media, start comparing yourself to yourself. You see, the only person I'm in competition with is the person I was yesterday. My life's not perfect, deep divers, but I'm an alchemist. I'm a Pisces. I'm an alchemist, deep divers. And I make the best out of the worst. It's impossible to bring Ralph Smart down. Why? Because I was born to shine. I didn't come here to feel sorry for myself. I didn't come here to be in despair. I came here to evolve. I came here to be in balance, harmony, love, peace, prosperity. Now, despair is a little part of that. Because in life, things don't always go your way. But my reaction, my response is so unique when it comes to despair. You see, how you respond to a situation how you respond to a situation <laughs> literally has the power to change the entire situation itself. So anytime you have despair, say, actually, let me change my response. If I feel bad, let me turn on some beautiful music. Let me become an alchemist. Let me turn a bad situation into a more harmonious one. Let me phone a friend. Let me stop suppressing my emotions. Let me express myself. Seven day vegan challenge. Let me make a delicious Buddha bowl, brown rice, quinoa, avocados on top, tomatoes, lettuce. Now I'm feeling better about myself. I'm feeling so good. Deep divers, how to get out of your despair. Realize this every single day. You have a choice about what you become based on your thoughts your thoughts are creating your reality to move out of to move out of despair take responsibility for the thoughts you are having take responsibility for the actions you live by take accountability for your life and realize you can control your internal condition. You may not be able to control what's happening out there. You can always control what's happening in here. Every single day, deep dives, I say, Ralph, cancel the pity party. Instead of the pity party, what's happening? We're having a celebration. Because in a pity party, by all means, have one. Afterwards, ask yourself how you feel. A lot of the times people feel the same. It's a release, but a better release and a better change is to have a celebration party. What's a celebration party, Ralph? If you feel despair, do something today that makes you happy. Because the only way to move out of despair is to not become a vibrational match to what you are experiencing internally. You have to raise the frequency. You have to go one step higher than what you are experiencing. Every single day, deep divers, remind yourself you're not alone in this. We are only alone when we abandon ourselves. If you are going through despair, keep going. If you're going through hell, keep going. Because 
there is a light at the end of the tunnel. There is hope when you don't give up on yourself. Your future's bright. So don't give up on yourself and be gentle right now, deep divers. A lot is happening on the planet and that's why you're feeling despair. But you can pull yourself out of this. You've done it once and you can do it again. You didn't come this far just to stay the same. Just to come this far. You came this far to keep going further. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. And then just say, Feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Beautiful deep diver. Shout out to everybody here. Shout out to everybody who's been getting the magnificent good ass prana shirts at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com if you're in America. And if you are a sexy ass model, woo! With a whole lot of heart who wants to model the clothing, well, go and buy some. <laughs> Let me know why you have what it takes. Add me on Instagram, Deep Divers, the new Instagram page at official Ralph Smart for more daily inspiration and Facebook at Ralph Smart for more daily inspiration. Check out the new book, Deep Divers. If you feel despair, this book will help you. It will change your life. Feel Alive by Ralph Smart on Amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book. Deep Divers, we are not what we are going through. We are not our thoughts. We are only experiencing them. So don't feel defined by what you are going through currently because four words, this too shall pass. And you're gonna have a, you're gonna have a phenomenal story, deep divers, to share. Have a beautiful day. Peace. Infinite waters diving deep once again. Stay well, stay healthy. Peace. You! What doesn't kill you, deep divers, will only make you more powerful. Keep going. You look fantastic, by the way. Have a beautiful day. Peace.